Today we'll implement sentiment analysis using Bedrock AI21 Labs model and using SageMaker. So let's begin with the tutorial. We are at the AWS console. Now first thing we need to check whether the model is available or not. So we'll click on Amazon Bedrock here because AI21 model will be using from Bedrock, correct? So that's why we are navigating here. Let's click on get started. On the left hand panel, uh, we have the model access. Let's click on it and let's scroll down here. We have the Jurassic 2 mid, the access is granted. So that is what is required. So uh, there's a, a story of AI21 Labs in collaboration with AWS regarding the deep learning. You can um, uh, have a read later, right? So let's open one new tab and as per the architecture diagram, let's go back. We'll be using SageMaker Notebook instance, right? And there we'll be using Python. So let's go back here. Let's type SageMaker, Amazon SageMaker. On the left hand panel, we have uh, the notebooks under application and IDs. Let's click on notebook. Here we have create notebook instance. Let's click on create notebook instance. Next, we need to name a notebook instance. Let's name it Cloud Guru Amit. Now let's choose the instance type. So since this is a very basic tutorial, so T2 medium is fine. Though we have a long list of powerful machines as well, uh, like GSX 448X large, right? We don't need so much power here. The smallest one will suffice for this tutorial. And under the platform identifier, we don't have much option. This uh, lab one, I believe was uh, uh, deprecated few uh, years back or um, something like that. But uh, we will use the latest one as of now, lab three. And now let's select one AM role. So basically your Siege maker should be having the uh, kind of um, full access so that you can perform the task, right? So now uh, let's uh, leave everything as it is now click on create notebook instance all right our instance is uh, now ready so please make sure to keep the naming convention as uh, one word it works space might not work so our instance uh, since it's uh, ready now uh, we are uh, ready to open like uh, let's go back here let's wait for the status it's currently pending let's uh, see the green tick mark then our uh, notebook instance will be ready and will be ready with the uh, python script so let me show you what uh, the sentiment analysis uh, looks like so we are using um, definitely uh, pandas library for the python and here we have uh, the customer ids these are these values currently are hard coded in a file but uh, later since these uh, we are since picking up the pace for generative ai right so that's why I have hard coded. We'll automate the process as the technicality and the difficulty will increase with later on tutorials in this series, right? And so here we have got the uh, sentiments or the, I mean, the of uh, customer feedbacks, right? Different customers, different feedback I have, we have got and we need to analyze, right? Let's say I'm a company, we are a company and we want to analyze how the product reviews are going on whether they are going positive negative neutral those kind of things right so uh, we, uh, you might be knowing about the data frames concepts if you're following my tutorials right we are creating data frames here and uh, you might be already familiar with the temperature and all right uh, in bedrock so we have uh, used uh, like uh, the more uh, the number like uh, one right it will be more creative or random and the lower the temperature the more precise uh, will uh, the output will be focused on the main thing to note is the model id as mentioned we will be using ai21 mid right so this this is one of the important part here right so let's um, this is somewhat the uh, code looks like so let me copy paste and keep things uh, ready all right our instance seems ready now because if you see here in service it's also the green check mark and also we have got options for open jupiter let's click on open jupiter 
all right our notebook if you look uh, is currently the list is empty we need to create one fresh one let's click on this button that is the new next we'll go to conda python 3 let's click here next we need to rename it's untitled not looking good we can rename by clicking it over here as well left clicking another option is file then we can go to rename here it serves the same purpose whatever is convenient you can do it so now uh, net, let's uh, name something so customer sentiment analysis let's click on the rename button here now we can see it's renamed customer sentiment analysis now this code we are copying this now let's i uh, will paste it here let's right click and paste it we are good now let's click on the run button all right we got the output so we have the statements here and uh, the sentiment it says positive only sentiment which we got negative is the third one or the like uh, the between one if you look here if uh, and read i'm not satisfied this product this is definitely negative feedback right uh, it did not meet my expectation so all the other are positive if we read it's uh, uh, like uh, the product quality is excellent this is helpful these are all po positive right great value for money the packaging was uh, damaged but uh, if you read here this is there's a trick here the packaging was da damaged but the product itself is good so that being said it's a positive sentiment that's what it has judged correctly so we can see how powerful it is even sometimes confusing words uh, the customers might have written but it our uh, siege maker judges everything perfectly based on the ai21 model which we have used here now uh, let's uh, check something in real time here now the product quality is worse cloud guru amit provides better product than what i got now let's click on run and here we can see it's negative and uh, that's the magic i have checked in the real time so i have compared let's say uh, this is abc company something other company and i'm comparing the products with my company that my company's product uh, are better some customer has written some feedback so it is definitely a negative feedback for uh, like the abc company or any company you can name it right so it automatically becomes negative so all the sentiments are absolutely um, correct as um, used by the model bedrock model ai21 labs right so that what concludes this tutorial so this is the architecture diagram which we have implemented straight from the scratch right so we have uh, used first of all uh, bedrock ei21 labs model which we have integrated in the uh, siege maker and then uh, here we have written the python code to analyze the customer sentiments so i hope you found this tutorial helpful thank you so much for watching this video if you have missed previous parts of this video you can check under the playlist section of my channel then you can check on the uh, aws gen ai ultimate course where you will be finding the list of all the videos which i have uploaded till date